I'm Jerry from Android Central, and we're going to have a look at PenUp, a new social network from Samsung for people who like to draw. Hey everybody, Jerry here from Android Central. We're having a look at the PenUp app by Samsung. Uh, it's a new social network for people who like to create their own artwork. I'm, I'm using it here on the Note 3. It also runs very well on the Galaxy S4, the Note 2, which I don't have on hand, and the Galaxy S3. That means there are quite a few of you out there who have access to this application, and I want to make sure we talk about it a little bit because I really enjoy it. Uh, pardon where my finger bumped a great picture of somebody's cat named Muffin. But think of this as Instagram for people who want to create the picture instead of take the picture. You'll find a lot of stuff that's really good. You'll find some stuff you don't like as much. But uh, art is, you know, in the eye of the beholder. Here's one. I like this little stained glass collage. So I'll tell him that I think it's nice. You can comment, of course. And he's had what social network would be any good without commenting, I don't know. But uh, you tell them that you think it's nice. All artists always appreciate knowing that people like their work. Scroll down. Uh, it's not endless. It does have a bottom. The network's fairly new, but there's still a lot of content here to look through. So, of course, you can filter it out by searching. You can search for the trending tags in all the pictures or popular artists. Let's go back to the tags. I like doodles. Let's pick doodles, give it a second to parse all its data, come through and well, there's somebody that really likes their note and showed us the way I love to see so we'll give that a market as a favorite, you can think of that as a like or a plus one, let him know that somebody out there really likes what he did go back through and as we mentioned this is a social network so you've got a profile here we'll go ahead and look at what the, that consists of, you've got your avatar your username, which you'll need to sign up. You can tell people a little about yourself and your website. Connect other social media. Even create a personal watermark that'll show on all the pictures that you post. We're not going to save any of that. You can follow people. People can follow you. And there are, you know, things that people have marked as, as favorites of your stuff. Go back. Your feed. Those are the people you are following. Uh, the more people you follow, the more content that will be there. Popular is, you know, artists that a lot of people are following. That's always a good indication of good work. I think this is a great sketch, so thumbs up. Nicely done, sir. Go back and see what else we've got. Everything. That's a little bit of everything, and it's mostly safe for work. I, I don't know how curated this is, but uh, I haven't seen anything that's not tasteful. Let's put it that way. The Hall of Fame, I hope I pronounced this gentleman's name correctly, Benive. This is an exhibition of all his work. It's all wonderful. It's hard to choose one, uh, but I really love these sunflowers, and I want to make sure I tell him as much, so I have marked those as a favorite of mine. Very nicely done. You have categories that are predefined, animals, characters, collage, comics, doodles, graffiti. Let's just tap one. And again, it takes a few seconds to parse it all. You can search by what's popular or by what's new. We'll go back here to what's popular. Scroll down and have a look. Uh, you can see the things other people have done, and you'll find a lot of great content there. Oh, that's a really nice abstract painting. I want to mark that as a favorite. And there's more categories there. Illustrations, political, I'll have no parts of that, I'm sorry. Uh, and of course, you can share your own artwork, which is the funnest part. Hit the airplane icon, and if you are using a note, you, you already know about the pen and SketchUp or Sketchbook Pro, one of my favorite apps. Uh, you can create some really nice illustrations and drawings of any style. When you're done with that, you use the regular Android Intent system. Tell it which program you want to find a picture from and choose the picture. It puts it in place. You're asked to give it a title. Uh, I'll title this one Rex because Rex is his name. And he is my little dog. You can also put hashtags in your description, and you'll want to do that, make it easier for people to find your stuff. Tell it what folder you want to share it in if you have more than one. I'm not going to post this because I already posted it the other night. Uh, I don't want to post it twice. But if I did, you'd see it. You can see it right there. 
in the top of my posts, and it would be visible for anybody that's following you, and they can interact with it. This is a really nicely done application. Uh, it's I think it's something that should get very popular. A lot of people like to create artwork with the S Pen uh, or just a regular stylus on their other Galaxy devices. This gives you a chance to look at what others has, have done as well as create the great stuff that you've done. I'm glad Samsung had us you know, take a look at it for you. And we'll talk more about it in the coming weeks because we've got a really good contest going on. So make sure you read the post and stay tuned. I'll talk to you later.